As another example of the drawing process, I'm going to use the press tool that I have already posted the components on Moodle. So these are the components for the press tool assembly. We have a base plate, a bush, a pillar, and a top plate. This is the press tool assembly, and this one is exploded uh, view of the assembly. So we have this press tool assembly and the, this exploded view. So once this press tool is open, go to application, select drafting, standard size, and for the size select A3, scale is 1 to 1. Make sure always the start view creation is checked and select base view command. Apply. Close this dialog box. Select base view. And here for the model, model view to use, select isometric. For the scale, select 1 to 2. Move your cursor and locate the isometric view on the top right corner. Now close the dialog box. Go to the exploded view. Application. Drafting. Again, you're back to the drawing environment. Select the base view. From the model view to use, select Trimetric view, move your cursor and locate the Trimetric view here in the bottom left corner. Close this dialog box. Now part list. Click on part list from table group. All the components are listed here. Set this one as leaves only and locate the table on the bottom right corner. Now you can change the size of your table if you want. Cell settings. Right click and then cell settings. Select lettering and here for the height you can change it to 7. For example, then close it. So the size, of the format size is larger now. Now I'm going to use this balloons. Click on balloon from annotation group. Type one. So here you can see that the base plate is um, the first component then pillar, then the top plate, then the push. So I would click here on the base plate, drag the mouse, and click once more here. So here you can see that number one is associated with this base plate. Number two is pillar. So here I would type two, click on this pillar, drag, the cursor and click once more here. So number two is located here. Number three is the top plate. So I would again select this top plate, drag the cursor and click once more here. So you see, I didn't type number three here. You can get rid of this one. Again, select the balloon. Type three for the text. Click on this top plate, drag the cursor, and click once more here. Number three is associated with this part. Now type four. Click on this push component. Move your cursor and click once more here. And this is number four. 
Now again, you can change this uh, font size for these balloons. Select setting here. Again, you can change it to seven for the height. So they are now larger. So here we have the geometric view, and this uh, isometric view for our assembly, which can be used for the manufacturing process.